Don't update to iOS 18. Because after updating to iOS 18, you will find that the album layout becomes chaotic. In addition, the battery life of the phone becomes worse and the iOS system becomes unstable such as black screens freezes, and so on. If you have already updated, don't worry. Watching this video is already half the success. Next, I will teach you step by step how to downgrade iOS 18 to iOS 17 in two ways. Before returning to iOS 17, you must make the following two preparations. Ensure that your phone has sufficient battery power. Back up your phone data on iCloud or iTunes. If you choose iCloud on your iPhone, go to Settings Your Name iCloud, click on iCloud Backup, then turn on the iCloud Backup switch and click Backup Now. At this time, your iPhone will upload data to iCloud for backup. If you use iTunes, connect your iPhone to the computer via a data cable. When iTunes recognizes your device, a device icon will appear in the upper left corner. Select this computer as the backup location and click Backup Now. After completing the data backup, I will show you how to downgrade iOS 18 to iOS 17. Method 1. First, open the website ISPU.com and find the model of your iPhone. Then download the signed one. Next, connect your iPhone to the computer via a USB cable. Next, turning off Find My iPhone before running iTunes and open iTunes. On the device summary page, hold down the shift key, Windows system, or the option key, Mac system, and at the same time click the check for updates button. In the pop-up file selection window, select the iOS 17 firmware file you downloaded earlier. After clicking OK, iTunes will start the downgrading process. Please keep the connection between the device and the computer stable and do not disconnect the USB cable. Note that after the downgrade is completed, your phone data will be completely erased. After the normal downgrade is completed, your iPhone will restart and return to iOS 17. However, using this method, there may be a situation where your iPhone cannot be restored. Therefore, I will introduce you to a second, more secure method. Method 2. Here we will use an efficient software called AnyFix. AnyFix is a professional tool for fixing Apple problems. It can not only upgrade slash downgrade the system but also provide three ways to fix more than 150 Apple problems with one click. Additionally, it can reset the iPhone with slash without a password in two ways. Next, let me teach you how to remove the iOS 18 beta. First, connect your iPhone to the computer via a USB cable and open the AnyFix application. So you can see the page and click the upgrade slash downgrade iOS option. After entering, we click the downgrade. And then, we can see the iOS 17 firmware and click this to download. After the download is completed, click downgrade here. Note that after the downgrading is completed, your phone data will be erased, but we can restore it from the previous backup. Finally, after waiting for the phone to turn on, you can start setting up your iPhone. Thank you for watching. It is said that people who like this video after watching it will become luckier in 2024. If you have any questions, welcome to leave a comment.